While more than 300 miles divide the two universities, many in the Big Sandy region are near the border of the Bluegrass and Mountaineer State. And for some, that makes it difficult to align with just one of the two fan bases. WYT's Alex Casper Pete caught up with one Floyd County teacher that is catching some flack from the Big Blue Nation. As you walk into Sharon Collins Resource Room at Allen Central High School, you may think she will be cheering on West Virginia Thursday. Go Big Blue. C A T S cats cats cats. <laughs> and seeing a UK cheer from someone in a WVU shirt may also be confusing. The West Virginia alum says she did not lose a bet. Her heart is just with both teams. Sometimes I switch back and forth. Um, that happens a lot. Um, you know, I follow them. Collins wore a Mountaineer shirt two days out of the week and plans to put on a royal blue shirt to cheer on the Cats by Thursday. But I've been in Kentucky for 28 years, and if you're an avid sports fan, you can't live in Kentucky without um, loving the Big Blue Nation. Despite her confession for the Cats, those around Collins continue to trash talk as the letters WV cover her car and classroom. She's not really it's not playing it fair as a fan, all right, because if UK wins, she's good. If West Virginia wins, she's good. So that's kind of the, the razzing that's been going on. Colin says the ending of the game will be bittersweet, but she hopes to continue cheering on her cats all the way to 40-0. I think everybody has played every way possible against Kentucky, and they still win, and it's going to be another one. The Wildcats only need four more wins to end the season perfect. In Floyd County, Alex Casper Peak to BYMT Mountain News.